Hi everyone, welcome back to Plum Mashable. So I'm going to be sharing with you today my mum's Christmas present. This was the planner I bought her in the 30% off haul I did uh, back at the start of December. I have waited until after Christmas to show you guys this for my last festive Fridays for two reasons. Number one, it was very highly requested. Um, and number two, because I didn't want to put it up before Christmas and spoil it for her. So I'm just going to show you how I've set this baby up. So you take it out of its box. I still am having lust issues with this plan. It's gorgeous. Um, so just in the box, I've got the two um, glitter tapes that came with this and then the excess paper, which I'm giving to my mum to use if she wants to. She doesn't have to. And then we've got the planner. So you can see from this, the front here that I have uh, the ornament that I bought in that haul as well. I'm using that as my page marker or divider or whatever. I've just tied it off with some twine and I've put it up way so that it actually sits out the top because I think it looks really nice hanging out. So then you open this up. You can see there you've got the page marker just there. I'll show you a bit better when we get there. So on the left hand side I've put some of the A Note For You gold paper that Kiki K have um, in the, the letter range just because I thought it looked nicer with the gold and the black than just the regular little notepad that they give you. Um, I then cut the front of that out, stuck that down just for a bit of extra decoration um, and these are just some little page flags from Officeworks and I'm pretty sure I gave her the others, I think they're in here. Um, also in here I've got the stickers that came with this collection and there'll be a couple of extra little gold paper clips for her there as well. And then I haven't done a dashboard for her but as you can see I have done something a bit different with her dividers. So what I've done is I've made them up just out of the dividers that came with them. I've just printed out pictures about the same size, stuck them down, cut them out and then laminated them. Um, so these are all completely customised obviously. Um, so you got a picture here of my, my mum and my two nephews because my number one, my nephews are extremely photogenic. Number two, my mum loves them more than anything. So I wanted to, to use them and plus my sister is a really good photographer. She's got some good photos. So you'll see them in just a second. And then on the back of this one, at least I've just written, um, put a quote card from the Thrive range with some, just covered the back with some paper and with a sticker. So this first section is her monthly section. I've just gone through and written everything that she needs to know now. So birthdays, um, footy games, which if you live in our family is more important than anything else is when we're at the football. Um, so that's all in there for her. Then got the second divider here of my sister and my baby baby nephew at the football. And then at the back, I have the whole of the son's um, fixture there for her. She's a big son's fan, so this way she can look at it um, and, and be able to just sort of know at a glance where we're going. Um, and I just downloaded this uh, a boy on the Big Footy website, and I'll link it down below, um, the thread on the Big Footy website. He's actually designed these up. They look gorgeous. So thank you very much to Tim for that, because that was amazing. Uh, this next section is my weekly section, or her weekly section, sorry. Um, and as I said, I've got the page marker here and it's just tied on with a piece of string or twine. And it just sits at the top as opposed to at the bottom. Um, and you can just move that to whichever page you want as you move along the year. So that's really, really simple. And then on the next one, I have another picture of my other nephew. And then just I've just covered the rest basically with just plain paper just depending on which one I wanted to use. I haven't set the rest up for her, I've kind of left it for her to do. You do need, you don't have to have them personalised their own, but when you're giving a planner I don't like to sort of set it all out perfectly for them. I like to kind of leave it so they can personalise it a little bit more. So you've got another one there, some of the beautiful Live Bright Diamonds on the back. Another one there with some of the Why Not paper, which I think that yellow looks absolutely gorgeous. And then the last one, just of the boys together, and then some from the Thrive Range. Is that the Thrive Range? I think that's the pink side of the Thrive Range. And then just at the back, I've just given her one of the plastic pockets. This is just out of the Why Not range. It was the only one I could find that kind of didn't have a colour theme to it. A lot of the other ones had pink dots or pink hearts. Um, and then I've just left the note paper from, like the notepad, from the pad in here, from the planner in here. Um, and then I've put the pen in here as well. So I've definitely stayed with the gold 
black and white kind of theme. I think that's the right way to go with this. And I think it's actually come up really, really nicely. I really love this planner. Like, not how I've set it up, I like the planner itself. And if it's still around after Christmas and it's on sale and I have my birthday voucher, <laughs> I think this one might be coming home with me. Maybe, we'll see. So that is it for this video guys I hope you liked it I hope she, more to the point I hope my mum likes it I really hope she likes this planner I'll let you know what she says um, when she says it I'll leave a comment down below and let you know what she what she thought of it um, this is also it for my festive Fridays thank you guys for coming along on this two month journey of celebrating Christmas and all things festive it's, it's been a lot of fun to sort of do a theme but um, I have a new series coming up for you next month so stay tuned for that and I also need lots of ideas from you guys for that series so you'll see all about it next week hope you have a really great new year's guys and I will see you on Monday see you later bye